Welcome to the Florida Arts and Dance Company, located here in Stewart, Florida. I'm Brian Garner, longtime local TV news reporter, longtime board member, and volunteer at FADC. Join me as we meet some of the committed supporters of FADC and get a glimpse of some of the wonderful work this organization is doing right here in our local community today. FADC has an important mission, enhance the cultural awareness and inclusion of our community through dance-related outreach programs and by providing individual dance education, training, and performance opportunities. Today, FADC is a strong and vibrant organization that serves as a forum for artistic development and expression throughout the Martin County area. We offer our students instruction in a variety of dance disciplines, including ballet, point, tap, jazz, and hip-hop. These programs are open to students of all ages in our community. Each year, FADC works to expand its performances, and we're proud of all the performance opportunities we offer to a wide variety of community members. During the holiday season, we feature our biggest production, the Nutcracker Series, at the historic Lyric Theater in downtown Stewart. It always attracts a great audience, receives enthusiastic support from the community, and it is a true source of pride for FADC. But FADC is much more than a traditional dance studio. Our nonprofit status and the partnerships we've forged with other community organizations set us apart. FADC's existing community services include dance-related programs designed for special needs children and adults, as well as at-risk youth. Let's take a moment to hear from some of our community partners and our instructors who work closely with these organizations to get a glimpse into the important work that FADC does to serve a variety of segments of our community's at-risk population. We were very privileged to have Miss Peggy from Florida Arts and Dance for 15 consecutive weeks doing ballet with our girls. I love the fact that Florida Arts and Dance provides all facets of dance to our youngsters in the Martin County area. Florida Arts and Dance is always outreaching to different areas within the community, but this was our first time here in the East Stewart area. They had great moves, great twirls, and they were beautiful ballerinas. One of my favorite things that I've done this year as an outreach instructor at Florida Arts and Dance Company is to work with clients from the Arc of Martin County and from the exceptional student group at Jensen Beach High School. Through the generosity of our community supporters, FADC is proud to assist non-traditional students in reaching their own dance and fitness related goals. Providing a quality dance education helps build the self-esteem and confidence of many unique and incredibly talented and driven individuals within our local community. We've had some wonderful teachers. This organization has been wonderful to open doors for our students just not only for Florida Arts and Dance Company but into the community because a lot of the parents see them here so when they, my kids go out in the community people are saying hi to them. Every mom wants to see her little girl dancing and be a ballerina and it, to just see them in the pretty costumes and when you have a child that has a disability that's not always so. You can't always find that. A client named Tammy came in and was very hesitant to jump from two feet to two feet. Within two months of encouragement and help, she was able to jump on her own and to actually ask in our next couple of sessions that we had to uh, have jumping as part of the movement experience. We kind of did cardio with Miss um, Jessica and then um, the next dance we did our morning go like facing wall one, wall two, wall three, something like that. Dancing is such good exercise for her. It keeps her in shape, gives her good muscle control. Each year we are able to partake in the Florida Arts and Dance Nutcracker where Jordan has a vintage wheelchair and she's in the prologue and in the party scene and this year she also had the opportunity to be part of the Baker scene. This summer at First Baptist Jensen Beach we started a program called Learning Independence University which was for individuals 18 to and older that get no services from the government. 
So it was a free program that went from 8.30 in the morning to 5 in the afternoon. And uh, Florida Arts and Dance Company was a huge part of that. Every day they came and we did exercises and we did dance moves. And I just think it's so important because my, my kids don't get that if, if it's not given to them. So. Exercises first and then we dance. And then, then we dance with arms. Arms and you spin around. Florida Arts and Dance also offers a significant scholarship program. Through the generous financial support of our community, FADC is able to award scholarships each academic year to a number of deserving students. These financial packages directly support the passion and talent of these dancers. They allow participation in the Nutcracker performances and otherwise ensure that students are able to continue to develop through their top flight dance education at FADC. Parents and students who have received these awards say the program has made a real difference in their lives. Let's hear from some of our past scholarship recipients. I started at Florida Arts and Dance when I was five years old. Twenty years later, I am now the programs director here, help coordinate all the outreach classes. And we were trying to find a studio um, that felt like a family and home and also would offer a scholarship. We were making a big transition and financially wanted to keep her dancing but weren't able to. Um, cover the whole cost. It was my way to escape all the troubles of the world growing up as an ESC student with a specific learning disability and dyslexia. I've been dancing for eight years. I take tap, ballet, jazz, tap, lyrical, junior company, nutcracker. I love dancing and without my scholarship I don't think I would be dancing. FADC is blessed with a tremendously talented and committed team of instructors, staff, and supporters. Our staff and volunteers work very hard day in and day out, and they always remain focused on our core mission. I am here today as a representative of the FADC board. We feel it's a privilege to be part of this great organization, and we are committed to our community outreach programs, and we strive to be a top-notch dance studio in Martin County. This is Lori Hickey, Executive Director of Florida Arts and Dance Company. On behalf of our dedicated and talented staff, we thank our volunteers and supporters, without whom we could not reach our full potential within our community. FADC's community outreach and inclusion efforts, together with our robust scholarship program for deserving dance students, represent a vital part of our local arts community. With continued financial assistance from our exceptional supporters, the sky's the limit for our organization and for the people in our community who can learn and grow from FADC's quality dance education, training, and performance opportunities. On behalf of the Florida Arts and Dance Company, I want to thank you for taking the time to learn more about community development through dance opportunities. Go FADC! Mm. Yeah! Do your twirls, do your twirls! It's a good organization about it, the FADC. And I love it here. My best friend is here and we love dancing together. I like dance, like Chris is a frog, swim lake. I love FADC. <laughs>